Let me tell y'all, I just worked out this morning at the gym. And I don't I don't usually work out, but like I need to start working out, like, you know, because whether I walked a mile on a treadmill and then I you know those things that you pull the arms down like this. I need to get my arms fat, like this is not no. I just want to start like whether I do a little bit working out, I just want to start doing it like every day or as much as I can so that my snapback game can be good because I ain't gonna lie. After I had CJ on, I got fat. But I was like I never worked out when I was pregnant with CJ. And y'all, I ate nothing but like bread and cheese and like a bunch of carbs. So, I haven't I don't know why Claire liked me to wash these. He just no, these need to be in the trash. All of these. I don't wash plastic cups and stuff like that. But yeah, um, I need these to soak in here too. Which part? But um, can y'all put something else besides like? Hard eyes, like, talk to me. What y'all be feeling about what I be talking about and what I be saying? Like, respond. Like, so, do y'all wash y'all dishes with a cap full of bleach, too? Do you put your dishes in a dishwasher? Like, come on, communicate with me, because I'm talking to y'all. But anyway, yeah, yeah, this is about to be a good meal. I just worked out, but so I feel so bad that I'm about to eat this big old southern meal. But I truthfully... I truthfully just miss like home cooking and stuff like that. I've been cooking a lot lately. And Claire messing around with me, he gonna get fat. So I wash my dishes with bleach. I never use bleach, but I'm gonna try it. Somebody said they wash the dishes with dish water. Come on now. Yeah, y'all, I'm telling you, using bleach. What the hell was that? Using bleach in your dishwater is really effective, y'all. I'm from, um, okay, so here's the thing. People always ask me where I'm from. I moved out of Detroit, Michigan to Houston, but I was born in Ypsilanti. Michigan. But I never say it's Selene because every time somebody like hear it, they don't know what it is. It's like what? It's Selene, Michigan. I was born in It's Selene, Michigan. But I lived in Detroit before I left. Guess what y'all? So the video I up uh, uploaded yesterday, cooking for my baby Zadi part two. Why I get copyrighted and I didn't even get paid for that video. But I'm a real G and I love my supporters. So instead of just deleting it, I just kept it up because I know that y'all like my content, you know. And I didn't want to delete it because just because I get paid for it. I just feel like then that would be like kind of like wrong and selfish because... Y'all like my content and stuff. Why would I delete it? I look a mess right now. I don't even know I'm on here. But I have to start this pot roast. Y'all, this is my favorite meal to cook. It be so tender and so juicy. And I have like the, the um... The, um, the red skin potatoes in there and and the carrots and the onions. So good. So good. What's up? What's up, everybody? Everybody that's just joining. Y'all, I want a girl so bad, but Claire, I don't know. 
He keeps saying, don't stop saying that. That's negative energy. He don't want a girl for his first child. He want a boy. He said that he don't want to have to be shooting people for his daughter. I just hate the whole double standards. Like, because he was like, yeah, if I have a boy, da da da, da he get like, he gonna be getting the cheeks. So I'm like, nigga, why is it double standards? But then when your daughter, like, come home, guys can get girls pregnant too. I don't know why they be acting like their sons can't come home and get pregnant. And you gotta worry about a lot of stuff with your son too, like him being out in the streets, him getting jumped, the police. Like, you gotta worry about so many things. Yeah, I do like washing dishes, though. You have to worry about so many things with your son, too. So, like, why do you be acting like having a girl is so bad? Having a boy is just as worse. When CJ get older now, I got to watch what he do, too. He, and, and they can come home. It can be a lot of stuff with your boy. Hold on. What is this? It's like, it's beyond. It could be a lot of stuff that go wrong with your boy. So stop thinking that just because you have a boy, you you not in trouble because you are. Facts. I need to get off live. I look like a whole maid. But this is what I love to do. When I'm at home, it's like my job never ends. Hold on. My job never ever ends, y'all. Like, if I'm at home, I spend the day cooking and cleaning, which is nothing wrong with that because I love doing it. When I have CJ, it's like double the work. Cause I I cook clean. Then I give him like I give him a bath and I tend to him and everything like that. When CJ's here, he should be back in a couple of days too. I'm taking him to Disney. Um and then I still go to the studio late at night to record music too. Nobody knows about that. My mind has to think to write songs. I write music all the time, so I have to think of all these new ideas. Then on top of that, I'm a YouTuber as well, so I have to think of all these new, these new videos to keep everybody entertained. And I have to deal with the foolery on social media. So my job is never finished, y'all. But guess what? That's so weird. They outside on the patio, but like I hear them talking through here. That is so weird. Yeah, my, my job never ends, but you know what? I truthfully don't have a problem. I love this. My favorite part, I think I love, I love playing all my parts. I love doing everything. What is that? Am I crazy or am I here? Do y'all hear that? They way over there, but I hear them over here. That is crazy. Am I? Have I been smoking? Like, what's been going on? That's me. Oh, that's on our video. He must have had that computer real loud. So the baby mama crew is flying out here on the 17th because on the 18th and 19th, I'm doing my mama's hand music video. And that baby mama crew is gonna be in it. Ari, Neek, and Carmen. So I really appreciate them for coming out because they didn't even have to. But the baby mama crew gonna be in my video and we all gonna be like, we gonna be, um, hey Brooklyn. We gonna be like, me and Ari gonna be playing with our kids, our sons and stuff. And 
Nick and Carmen gonna be rubbing on their bellies. And... How far along are they? Can somebody tell me? Like, when is a due date? When is Carmen due and when is um Nick due? This is what you call plain lazy because it's something on the stove, but I couldn't like find a scraper. So I'm using this, but it's working, boo. Nick due in September. Oh. Oh, she about to pop. Okay, when does Carmen do? I know, y'all tell me, but. When does Carmen do? Carmen do in October. Oh, whoa, whoa. Libra. Wait, I don't know if it's going to be Libra. But my birthday month is October. My birthday is uh, October 17th. So. I wonder when. Um, I wonder when. Um. I think both of my, I think um, my child is due in February. And the crazy thing is, I think I already told y'all this. CJ, is, CJ was due February too. And if I have two, two kids with February birthdays, it's going to be kind of easy for me because I can just celebrate their birthdays together. Get it out the way. Truthfully though, man, like I just, I'm excited. I can't wait. My gender reveal, we getting a date for that together right now. It's actually going to be kind of private, but it's going to be live so you guys can see it as well. It's going to be streamed live professionally on YouTube. Um, and we have the camera crew come out and everything. So it'll be like something big where everybody can see the gender reveal like right there, like they did with us. But it's going to be more so private. Probably just like have some family and close friends there. You know, close friends and like the other people and um, you know, like close YouTubers that I'm cool with. But like me, if it was me, like I invite the whole world. But I have to be considerate of Claire and his family too because they don't know everybody. And like Claire and them, they really, they really, really cautious people. Like they don't bring too many people around them. You know, they don't bring too many people around them. But me, I'd be like, come on, come, come on. <laughs> so it's going to be a little bit more private. Yeah, when I get big enough, I'll do the baby mama dance for y'all. I'm going to make Claire do it with me. If he still got a pregnant belly too. <laughs> hey, I'm alive, so don't say anything that you... You heard me? You heard me? You hear me? Yeah, I heard you. Dang. Because you're just looking at me. I'm like, you hear me? Do you hear me? He's like, I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you. What? What? What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Patty Pat, M-O-D. Man of Dreams what? out now. Man of Dreams out now. Go Why stream is Claire that. looking at me like that? Can you say that one time? Man of Dreams out right now. Go stream that. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Go stream that. I like that. Y'all hear Claire go say something. Who you talking to? Boy, I'm talking to you. <laughs> what do you think? You know what I'm saying? What do you think this is? What do you think this is? I'll run this shit. It's like, no, nah, I'm gonna stop. Where you see this and be like, <laughs> let me stop. <laughs> That's how people be starting stuff. Like, y'all hear what Queen said? Mm hmm. Y'all heard what Queen said? What is this? This is getting drawn up. How do I get off here? What's up, everyone? It's your girl, Queen B. Back in uh, 
It's your girl, Queen B. Queen Naja. Can y'all hear me? Can y'all hear me? Can y'all hear me? Yes, no. I have a public service announcement. I don't like this one. I have a public service announcement. I just have to say something really, really quick. First of all, I will, um, I have my camera with me. I'm in Kansas. Claire is still in Atlanta. He had to stay home because um, there's a delivery coming to the house. Him and Patty is here. So I have my camera. But my camera has um, footage of me. Footage of me at the doctor's appointment and everything. Tomorrow's my video shoot for Mama's Hand. Unfortunately, Carmen and Ari couldn't make it. But Nick's still coming. But I appreciate all of them for making the effort. Um, anyway, here's my public service announcement. I, Queen Naja Bulls, I am not here to please nobody. I got these hoops from Claire's. And I got this whole outfit. Hold on, let me open my window. No, that's terrible lighting. Might as well close it. Y'all are truly the reason, you know, why I am where I am now. Because, you know, I, I put out my videos and I put out content and I show y'all my life. And y'all watch it. All right. But I want you guys to understand that we both play a, a big part in this whole thing. If y'all didn't watch my videos, I wouldn't be where I am. But if I also didn't put out videos, y'all would watch the videos. So we all play a big part together. Um, I'm not that. I can lay on my stomach like a, a little bit. Sometimes it's okay. I just boo-boo truthfully. So like my stomach is like feeling not too full. So I can lay on my stomach a little bit. But when I get too big, I can't. Um, but anywho. Yeah, we all play a big role. And yet yeah, CJ is going to be in a music video. My mom is currently driving back to um, Atlanta right now. As I think she drove back today to uh, bring me CJ. And my mom will be in the video too. <laughs> Georgie texted me and said, don't lay on my stomach. Okay, all right. I won't lay on my stomach, Georgie. All right, but anyway, I just want to let you know that we all play a big role in each other's lives. My supporters pay, play a big role in my life, you know, because y'all really motivate me. And y'all always got my back. But I also play a big role because I put out the content for you guys to watch. Um, Haters and like negative Nancy's and miserable, miserable Margaret's play a really, really big role in my life too. Because y'all also motivate me. But y'all also get my nerves. But it's okay. But anyway, I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm not here to please anyone. Okay? I live my life on a daily basis. Not thinking about pleasing everybody else you know what i'm saying of course i put out content because i know that's what you know i know that's what y'all y'all love and stuff like that and i do little stuff but i'm not here to please nobody that means i'm not gonna wear just because i wear something yeah who's this oh i'm on live huh Anyway, I just want to let that means whatever I wear, 
I wore it because I like it. I'm not wearing it because you guys like it or because y'all don't like it. I'm wearing it because I like it. If I want to wear pink pants with purple polka dots and a red and white striped shirt, I'm going to wear it because I like it. I'm not here to please none of y'all. Okay? If I want to wear boots in the summer, I'm going to wear boots in the summer. If I want to wear a fur coat in the fall, I wear a fur coat in the fall. I'm not here to please y'all. Newsflash. Y'all do what y'all want. I'm going to do what I want. All right? If I want to be comfortable for a day and pull my socks way up over my knees, that's what I'm going to do. If I want to wear a, a rainbow wig, I'm going to wear a rainbow wig. You know why? Because I want to. You know what I'm saying? I really don't care how I look. I like to try out stuff. This tastes different. I, I don't like these. No, because it's tropical. I don't cool. like I it. This tastes tropical. nasty. I don't know why I'm eating it. Truthfully, I just want some sour punch straws. I don't, but not tropical. Yeah. Yeah, like... I'm not here to please y'all, like. 